The New York National Guard's historic 1st Battalion, 69th Infantry, is preparing for deployment this fall. The Guard is sending over 1,100 soldiers to the African Horn for a security mission in Djibouti and locations in Kenya and Somalia. We're basically going to be securing uh, installations in Djibouti, Somalia, and Kenya. Um, and that's not just perimeter security, but also actively patrolling to uh, deny uh, disrupt or prevent the enemy from massing attack on some of those installations. Although soldiers are joining the mission from across the state, they started here at Fort Drum to train for deployment in September. Training exercises now are focusing on the mission essential task list, including medical and first aid, weapon qualifications, and potential combat situations. The battalion's heavy weapons company is focusing its training to prepare for the active combat zone. We're the heavy weapons company for the battalion, which means we bring all the heavy firepower and machine guns to any fight the battalion commander dictates. This includes using advanced weaponry such as heavy machine guns, missile systems, and grenade launchers. So some of the things uh, we're doing uh, for this deployment as far as training, we're doing individual weapons uh, qualifications to make sure they are proficient with uh, each weapon. But battalion leaders said that soldiers are keeping a motivated attitude, even as this is the first deployment for the majority of the soldiers in the mission. This is my first deployment. I'm very excited to uh, be deployed and see a new part of the world. Um, one of the reasons I joined is to travel, and this is going to be a great experience for me and uh, the rest of the unit. Well, these soldiers are highly motivated. It's great. It's a great mission, and they're going to have not only the opportunity to, um, you know, to conduct, conduct a mission in, in furtherance of the national security of the United States, but they're also going to have amazing, amazing training opportunity with some of the uh, tier one assets of uh, the United States Army and the United States Navy. And after training wraps up here on Fort Drum during the first few weeks of July, soldiers will then head to Fort Bliss in Texas for two months before deploying to Africa in September. For ABC 50 Now on Fort Drum, I'm Isabella Colello. For more local news, go to InformNNY.com or download the ABC 50 mobile app.